so welcome to QT Newcastle. So welcome to QT Newcastle. <laughs> Hi. So welcome to QT in Newcastle. We checked in here yesterday just for a little one night stay. We love <laughs> we love our room here. I can't remember the room type, I'll put it up on the screen here, but it's room 308. It's really, ah, <laughs> it's really beautiful. One thing I love about it is it's got a few like original features from the original building, like this beautiful old beam here, and also these amazing, ah, <laughs> amazing windows over here. Really nice, big windows. It's really beautiful and as soon as we walked in there was just natural light the whole room was flooded with it it was beautiful huge bed little um sort of coffee area there's also a really nice bathroom here as well shower was great and we've had a really beautiful stay here it's really interesting staying somewhere that's close to home Hi. <laughs> which is sort of a test run for us our first little family outing um family stay which has gone well this room has room for a travel cot which we brought our own i'm not sure if they provide any do you remember if they do or i not? think they might i think they may but we just brought our yeah. own we, we chose this room because it had a bath in it some of the room types yeah. don't yeah so q2 here is actually in a really great location in newcastle we're a street or two back from the newcastle harbour there scratchley's you can walk around to nobby's beach the lighthouse we whipped around yesterday from here to the harbour up to nobby's down to Newcastle Beach and then back through the streets of Newcastle. I have to say, walking back to the streets of Newcastle, there's lots of beautiful old buildings that are being restored, including this one. There's a really nice feel in the air. It feels like a lot more people sort of live in here, locals, tourists. It was a really nice mix. It's a great location, close to some really great restaurants, coffee shops. There's Limerick Lane um, in behind, right behind here, which is a really beautiful little area. So yeah, we highly recommend this location in Newcastle. It's also quite close to the tram line there, literally just across the street. So super central, really easy to get around. You can walk to the different beaches, the harbour, coffee shops, everything you need is right here. So you can even definitely come here without a car, as long as you can make your way here via the tram um, as well. So that would be super easy. We drove, you can park sort of nearby in undercover parking. So also in the hotel there's a rooftop bar which you can see some water views and some nice views of just the area around the hotel. Uh, there's also some nice restaurants in the building and as a whole we really enjoyed the area that we're staying, particularly for restaurants and cafes. A few in the area that we like are for a coffee, it's the sister. We had dinner out last night, um, Betty's Burger, which we just wanted a quick dinner with Clara, so that, that was perfect. Um, other great cafes in the area that we like uh, uh, where we had breakfast this time was Edmund & Co. And Extraction is great for coffee as well as Good Brother which is another great option. But all in all, you're not going to be short of a great coffee shop or restaurant if you stay in this area. Yeah, so overall we've had a really great stay here, our first little family vacation. Um, Perfect for, I would say it's probably targeted more to 
young people, young couples, that sort of vibe around here, but it was great for a family stay as well. So yeah, definitely recommend whether you're a local who wants to just check out Newcastle a little bit more, or if you are coming from Sydney or further away, it's a great spot to stay if you're here to check out a weekender or something like that in Newcastle. Thanks so much for watching this video. We really loved our stay here at the QT in Newcastle and we linked our full article on our stay on our blog almostlanding.com in the link in the description below. Um, but we'll see you in the next video and thanks for watching.